Deadly crash happened at the height of the morning commute along Interstate 580 west of Tracy just after 7 this morning. Traffic was delayed for a few hours, but the road is now open. KPIX 5's Alan Martin is in the newsroom now with the latest from investigators. Alan? Yeah, Kenny, this story, of course, still very much developing. Law enforcement is going to hold a press conference shortly. We show you a live look outside the Dublin CHP facility where officers will update us with the very latest. And when that happens, we'll go right to it. But first, let's walk you through this morning's events. We have video from Chopper 5. The Alameda County deputy who was killed was riding in that VW bug. You can see the extensive damage to the back end of it. It's pretty much destroyed. Investigators say this bus contracted by Tesla slammed into the car near Grant Line Road. No one on the bus was hurt, but the deputy riding in that car was pronounced dead at the scene. Now, minutes after the crash, Chopper 5 caught this. The first responders had draped an American flag over the deputy's body. Then they stand back and they salute. Just about an hour ago, Chopper 5 was overhead as a procession was seen heading westbound on 580. Law enforcement officials bringing the deputy's body to the coroner's office in Oakland. You could also see there were other local law enforcement on the overpass paying tribute as the procession made its way down the freeway. Finally, at the coroner's office, officers could be seen hugging, embracing each other. They, of course, grieving the loss of one of their colleagues. Tesla sent out this statement about the crash, which reads in part, quote, all Tesla employees on the bus are safe and accounted for. However, we are deeply saddened by reports that there was a fatality as a result of the accident. We will lend any support that we can to the authorities who are investigating the incident. Again, we're waiting the news conference by law enforcement. We'll bring it to you just as soon as that happens. In the newsroom, Alan Martin, KPIX 5.